After making sure the antenna has been installed and the machine has been turned on, let's go to the next tutorial, which is about how to operate the machine and turn the machine off correctly. To operate the machine, you first need to connect to the Wi-Fi machine. If you use an iPhone, click Setting menu, then go to Wi-Fi menu, click On to turn your iPhone Wi-Fi on. Find the Wi-Fi high-tech terminal with the first name, tp-link. Click Wi-Fi tp-link on your machine. OK. At this time, your iPhone has been connected with the machine. Then go to Home. Open your browser in either Safari or Chrome. Now we will use Chrome. Click Chrome, insert the machine IP. One nine two dot one six eight dot one dot one hundred. Here you can operate the machine. The first thing you can do in this page is to insert the frequency channel which is gotten from your Nokia Frequency Finder handphone. The channel number we got was fifty eight fifty four. 51, 52. The channel list number here can be back and forth or free. Can be not in series. Let's invert it to be 54, 52, 51, 58. Then choose the operator as the frequency gotten. Then click Connect. OK, this machine has been turned on and actively scanned and handphoned around you, as with your operator choice. Click OK. Then let's make an advertisement message that we want to send. Insert the sender number here. Then insert your message text here. 70 characters and maximum. When it's done, click Add. At this time, your advertisement SMS has been made and ready to send. The way to send? Check the box first, then click Send. At this time, the machine has been sending the advertisement SMS to the people around you. Make sure the status is sending and the count keeps increasing. The number in this count shows the SMS that have been sent. After it's activated for a few seconds, the machine has sent SMS for more than 300 SMS. The number of SMS depends on the number of people around you. Oh, next is the way to turn it off correctly. Check the box first to the active advertisement. Then click Pause. Click Disconnect, then click OK. Click Shutdown, then click OK. After shutdown, wait until the CPU lights off. After the CPU lamp off, press the remote to turn the machine off. Make sure the fan has been turned off. Then turn off the electric switch. Take the cable off if there is no usage for long period of time. 